What is good, everybody? It is your boy Super Saiyan Cab back with another Xenoverse 2 skill test for you guys. I know it has been literally like over two weeks or something like that since we have uploaded a skill test or a, a test video to the channel, period. So today I figured I'd come with something a little bit special and a little bit different, and that is a skill test of unobtainable skills in Xenoverse 2. And these two skills are Father Son Kamehameha and Godly Display, two of the skills that everybody in the xenoverse community would love to have for their cac's so on this skill test guys not only let me know which skill you like better down below but also let me know which skill you would have liked to had more between these two for your cac as well as votes and suggestions for future test videos whether it's a character or skill test video now one thing i do want to mention about the anime recreation sub saturday that is what sub saturday is going to be this week guys this upcoming sub saturday if you guys did not see the previous video it is going to be based around the anime recreations the greatest anime recreation that's what you guys voted for huge shout out to sir j for that suggestion he's the one who suggested it and that's why i let you guys vote so again it's going to be your greatest anime anime recreation on xenoverse 2 send those clips to the email down below in the description but that's enough talking from me let's get into this skill test between father son kamehameha and godly display all right guys we're gonna get this skill test started with father son kamehameha and of course i cannot be using my cac since we cannot obtain these skills so we're gonna use super saiyan 2 team gohan instead of regular team gohan for two reasons one his key blast stats are a little bit lower than ui goku's so this could help balance that out the second reason is Father Son Kamehameha just does not look right in Super Saiyan 1, so we got to do this in Super Saiyan 2. Now, we're going to do this the same way as always, testing damage, speed, and then we're going to talk about the uses of the moves. Starting out with Father Son Kamehameha and his damage. Father Son is a move that has two different damage outputs. Sometimes it does its little extra damage, as you guys see right here, this did 14,009 damage. Sometimes it decides to do that, sometimes it doesn't. Like, I've tested it multiple times, multiple different ways, holding the button down, tapping the button, and it's just random, it seems. It seems sometimes it throws out extra, and sometimes it throws out not that much. As you guys will see right here, hopefully, I'm doing the exact same thing as far as the startup and all that, and this is another 14. Oh, see, that one was 9,241. So this move can vary from 9,241 damage all the way to 14,009. And again, I have not found any way to make that 14,009 happen every time i've held the button down i've pressed the button multiple times i've left my finger off the button and each way seems to be random when using father son kamehameha now when you talk about actual damage and how much key like damage to key ratio if you look at it father son is only taking three bars of key doing 14,009 damage at times regardless it does not matter if it does that extra damage or not it is still only going to take three bars of key, whether it does 9,000 damage or if it does that 14,000 damage for you. So that's always one thing to keep in mind is the amount of key that is taken up with these moves. Now, moving on to actual speed, obviously Father Son Kamehameha is one of the slower skills in the game. Like, look how long it actually takes to get the startup of it going. And again, as you see right there, I did nothing different from the other times that I've launched it. And for some reason, that time I did it again, 14,009 damage. When it comes to speed, it is definitely a very, very slow move. One of the slower ults, if not top five slowest ults in Xenoverse 2 without question. Now, when you move on to actual uses, you have to use this move with a heavy stamina break. There is no other way to land this move with Teen Gohan besides a heavy stamina break, guys. So immediately, I mean immediately after that heavy stamina break, you want to go straight into the Father Son Kamehameha and launch it right away. If you don't, your opponent will be able to recover, get up, and move away. So it has to be immediate after that heavy break. Go straight into the Father Son, and that is going to be your only chance of landing this move with Team Gohan. That is one of the downfalls of this move is how slow it is, but still a very, very punishing move that does some insane damage. It's just weird also with the damage, as I've said before, how it varies from like 9,000 all the way to 14. But that is everything for Father Son Kamehameha. Now we're going to move on to UI Goku and showcase Godly Display before taking these characters and moves online. 
All right, guys, now we're on UI Goku, and we're going to be testing Godly Display with him, of course. And Godly Display is another move that varies in damage greatly. If you have full key, as you see right now, Godly Display is going to do you some insane damage, as you see right here. It is going to do a total of 13,717 damage with full key with Ultra, uh, Ultra Instinct Goku. The issue with this move is the fact of if you do not have that much key, as you guys are about to see right here. Let me change the training settings to where key is normal. Waste some key real quick. Actually, let me use a meteor crash. That'll be the best way to waste it. And now only having a little bit under five bars. Actually, I need five bars exactly. So hold up. Having a little bit over five bars of key, look at the major damage difference we get with Godly Display. It goes from 13,717 all the way back to 8,188. So the more key you have with this move, the more damage you're going to get. The weakest you can possibly get from it though is 8,188 and the strongest is 13,717. Now when you talk about actual speed of this move, this move is instantaneous. It is, it is just like you literally teleport to your opponent as you guys see right there. It is a very fast ultimate. It's definitely way, way faster than Father, Son, Kamehameha. It's not even debatable. So when it comes to speed, Godly Display is definitely the faster move of the two. Now when you talk about uses, Godly Display is a fairly easy move to land. You can land it in multiple ways off the stamina break depending on how you want to do it. If you want to just do it immediately after the stamina break, you can go straight into it as you guys see right here. You're still going to get a lot of damage usually, which is enough to kill your opponent. Or if your opponent has a lot of health and you're looking for something extra, all you got to do is go into a com uh, immediate combo after the stamina break as you guys see right here. And then right after that, you can also use Godly Display and it'll connect all day, every day for you. Like you see right here, doing a little bit extra damage if your opponent has that little more health. But again, all you got to do with this move is a light break and either use it after a knockdown combo or light break right after the break. Use the move and it'll land for you all day, every day. Now that's enough for, I mean, that's everything, not enough. That is everything for these skills. Now we're going to take them online. First match is going to be with Father Son. Second will be with Godly Display. And I will see y'all a day. All right, here we go, y'all. With the first match with Team Gohan, we got to accomplish two things in this match. First and foremost, did he just try and grab from that far? Like, what? What? The, did he just try and stem? Oh, we got a supreme. We got a supreme noob on our hands, ladies. Oh, thank you. You supreme noob, bro. Like, what? Okay, back to the main objective. The two main objectives are one. We have to go Super Saiyan 2. Oh, my Lord. I feel bad for him, dude. Just, just go over there. We, we need to go Super Saiyan 2. Oh, wait. That only takes four bars of key, not five. That's right. That's right. That's right. Oh, he turned around. I, okay. Okay. I, I forgot that. What art? Bro, is this man serious? Like, is this real life right now? Let, oh, this is an act. This defines scrub in every sense of the, the word. Like, my God. Oh, that's right. It has super. I always forget that, bro how I, I i went behind this man and somehow he still seemed to hit me okay that's cool but i forget at times that's uh what's this what's it called has did i really just get hit by this shit twice see this is what happens when you t what nani why did the game freeze i'm not gonna stamina break you off that bullshit use your stamina up how he just appeared behind me bro and he okay 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 i'll take that damage I would really love to know how that happened. Like, seriously. This mo. Stop with your nonsense, bro. Get your bitch out. Okay, I almost missed the stamina break, but I got it at the very end. Come on. Hurry up. Launch. Launch. Okay, say goodbye. Oh, it did the weak version. Are you serious? We're going to grab him. No, we can't grab him when he's on the ground. Are you serious? Has it really been that long that I've forgotten? Stop just trying to back up. I'm not, like, this dude is annoying. Like, my God. Bro, are you serious, bro? My God. That was just... Got to the point where it was just annoying. I was just get, basically fighting Heavenly Arrow at that point. But as you see, it will work off a of heavy all day, every day. Alright, so here we go with Godly Display. And sadly, I cannot use it on my CAC just like Father Son. So we got to... Are you serious? Like, for real? Did he just go through my back hit Xenoverse? But did man's like really just charge up in front of me? Like I understand the Divinity Unleashed and he's trying to get that to work for him and, and whatnot. But still, come on, bro. Uh, no, I went right into that. How did I use stamina? I don't remember using stamina. What the hell? 
Where did my stamina usage come from? Oh, wrong move. I tried to use Soaring Fist. Wrong move. But where, when did I use stamina? Come here, bitch. Use your stamina. Thank you. Thank you. Come here. And take this godly display as you got. Like I said before, you can literally use it right after a stamina break. Now, it will not kill my opponent right here due to the fact that I did not have the most key in the world. But then I'm going to follow up with this right here. And a swing. Oh, 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 I didn't have any key, I guess. Wait. I thought it only takes one bar regardless. I didn't know it takes more based off how much you use. Okay, something just looked a little bit funky right there. I was using my UI abilities and then for some reason he wasn't even close to me and I was still having to use them. It was very weird. Use your back hit. Shit. I want to I end this on a grab. Not using his back hit. This is not good. Come. Whoa, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm not going crazy. There definitely is some funkiness going on right here. Say goodbye. Gotta hit you with the disrespect. But there was definitely some funkiness going on after I hit him with the godly display. But like I showcased right there, you can either use it in a couple ways with the stamina break. One being right after the stamina break and the other being right after a knockdown combo or something of that nature immediately after a light break. Oh, it's thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Now, be sure to not only let me know your thoughts on the vid, but which skill you like more between godly display and father son kamehameha and which skill you would like to have in the game as an actual cac skill between these two now my favorite between these two as far as in game goes would probably i'm gonna have to go with father son it's it's very close because godly display is such an amazing move but you guys know me i'm a major team gohan fan and the fact that father son go i mean father son kamehameha is like one of his shining moments shining moves I would absolutely love to actually just have it on my CAC. You guys have no idea how much I would love to have that move. But that's a main reason why it has to do with not only the game because it's an absolutely lit move. Can do up to 14,000 damage with three bars of key. But also due to the fact that Team Gohan is, again, just my favorite character of all time. So that's the one that I'm going to have to go with as far as the better one. And the one that I would put in um to have for my CAC. Let me know you guys' thoughts down below though on which skill you like better. And which skill you would like to have more in this game as something for your CAC. But again, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Until next time, I hope you guys have a good day. Peace, y'all.